Hello friends, I am Rohit. Today we are going to do a project called burglar alarm. So what is burglar alarm? If you have a diamond in your house and the thief wants to steal the diamond, he opens the door and what will happen? A buzzer will buzz no in your house. If you have in the jewelry shops, they will have. That's only we are going to do today. Now for today's project, we need Programmable cable, JST wire, 3 pin, and IR sensor, JST wire 3 pin, programmable cable, and min board connected to the VCC GND out of the IR sensor. I told you that you can't get the win board in the online shop. Except win board, all of them you can get in the online shop. Because it's from Ringy, the win board, that's why. Now let's, for today's project, we need buzzer. Here is buzzer attached to it. To it. I will show you how to do without the win board. Now, here, second pin, that, that is buzzer. And connected to the VCC of this. G, the buses to the VCC. And connect the programmable cable. This end should be connected to the Arduino. And this end should be connected to the laptop or PC. PC or personal computer. Connected to the computer. Or there is an uh, initial way. Here where is the connected? Nothing. See, it's buzzing. Now, our buzzer sounds good. Now, the second pin buzzer. No, no, I yeah, sensor one. Look, I will. When object is not there, one LED is glowing. When object is there, two LEDs are glowing. Look. Do you see? Yes. Okay. Now, sensor out. Yes, sensor out. IR1. IR to the buzzer. See, it's, an object is there, the buzzer will buzz. An object is not there, the buzz will not, buzzer will not buzz. So, that's all for today. I will show you how to do without the wind board. In, on Tinkercad. So, I think you have in mind, you should not, the Tinkercad, Saya sensor, you should not use. You should use this sensor only. You can keep it in the doors, in your door. House, uh, in the door of your house. House of the door. Is that good? You can do this practically, it is easy only. Now our main component is Arduino. It is a coding device. Which tends power to the components and coding. It is a control system and uh, sensor is input and buzzer is output. In sensor, we have sensor. Now I will repeat, I have told you many times that you should use this sensor only, not the Tinkercad sensor. You should keep it in the mind. If you use Tinkercad sensor, you will not be successful with the process. If you use this sensor, you will be successful. This is an example for Tinkercad IR sensor. This is an example for this sensor. You should use definitely this, not that Tinkercad IR sensor.
Now we need a buzzer that is piezo and color is black minus. So if you want to keep it in the door, you want to keep it in the door, you should, you should not always connect like this the programmable cable to the desktop and connect it to the Arduino and keep it in the door. The easier way is we can connect it to the 9V battery to this. 9V battery can give power to this. I will show you how. VI and GND no, that is the power to the Arduino. Here GND 5V. This GND and VND. VI and GND. First two are the power for this. We can connect it this also power. But it will look different. To connect it, it will look different. See, like this it will be. You can connect it to this also. But it, the cable will be different. So, if you want to connect with this, you can connect. I will show you how it looks. See, like this it will look. And connect like this. See, it's connected like this, and to the battery, nine volt battery. To this, to this. This here, no. This from this you can connect this. This hole that will be. I showed you. I fixed you like this is the hole. Can can you can connect the power to the Arduino like this, or by VIN GND. Let's connect it first. GND to the black and minus 3.3 volt. And remember, should keep resistor to this. To this IR sensor only. Take a IR sensor. You need not keep resistor to this because it has a resistor in the chip. So we connect it to the out. Eight and five volt to this and three point three volt to this. I think the buzzer is 3.3 volt only. So, I think the buzzer is 3.3 volt only. So, we can connect it to 3.3 volt and the IR sensor to the 5 volt. Slowly to the buzz. Let's check with the IR remote because the IR sensor is the it is connected to the IR remote only. An example for I'm giving because the Tinker Hat has no IR sensor like this. Look, this is the only like this it will look. See, see, it's functioning. So you need not use this remote. You need not to use this remote and the IR sensor. It is not working, so I am using the IR sensor awning this and then only it is because the IR sensor is connected to this. This IR sensor is not connected to the IR remote. You keep it in mind. Okay. Now I think you have it 
kept it in mind there is no coding area for this now one coding is done on start no, no coding is there sorry so that's all for today to keep it in mind that you should not use this IR remote and this IR sensor in the Tinkercad. You should use this IR sensor only to do it practically in the door. So that's all for today. Thank you, friends. If all who are not subscribed my channel, please subscribe, like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. Then only you can watch my videos. Please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you, friends.